Well, good, wonderful, beautiful, not gonna lie. It's six o'clock in the evening, audience. Yeah, six o'clock in the evening. Jamie got home last night. He slept in for a little bit this morning. It's um six o'clock in the evening. And why am I vlogging now? Well, because we have some clips that Jamie took and his cousin took while he was up in Canada. And we're gonna insert them into this video right here. So it's not gonna be an only Canada vlog because they didn't film a ton. I told them not to worry about it, just to film when they felt like it. But we knew you guys would wanna see some of what happened in Canada. So we're gonna insert those clips momentarily, but first. We're supposed to be getting a snowstorm tonight and uh, it just started. So hopefully we'll get a nice new coating of snow on the ground. We could, we could use it. Cause we would like to go sledding, wouldn't we? She's like, yeah, I would totally like to go sledding again. Let's do it. Well, we gotta wait and see if we get some snow and then maybe we'll go. Yeah, so we're watching it snow, making some dinner. And uh, here are the clips that they got while Jamie went on his trip to Canada. Roll the footage. <laughs> All right, so this is how I'm going in. Head up to the sled. Alright, so we made it to camp. That's how I packed it. I wore the helmet, obviously. But we got that tote, and that tote, and that tote. Is that it? That's it? Three totes for your sled, eh? That's pretty cool. And our little cabin here. Look at the snow on the roof, guys. That's nuts. Ooh, maybe we'll get a nice sunset. I see it back there, Chris. <laughs> All right, time to get unloaded. Here's inside the small little retreat we have. We a stove, some pots, some pans, a fridge. Oh, I don't have my glasses, so I can't see anything. We're, as you can see, my glasses are frozen right over. We just came in from uh, from fishing. Oh, it is so cold. It is freezing outside, so it's nice to, I can't see anything, <laughs> but it's nice to have the the shelter, all this cool stuff. Let's see what we got here. Uh, there's a window. I think we think these are some of the trains that used to come up here to these cottages up here. That's cool. A little fan, got a nice wood stove, gonna need a log on that. Got, and then it's turned the other direction, and there's two bedrooms, one bedroom, a utility room, and two bedrooms, and that's the door I just showed you. A nice little table going on here. Some Doritos, we don't have alcohol or anything. Just, just the Coca-Cola. None, none of this, this doesn't exist. <laughs> it's pretty cool. I'm living out of a tote. You got fresh water. You got lake water for washing hands. All right, well, the guys are back, so I'm going to talk with them. I, I can see. Hey, look, my glasses are thawed. Well, it's morning at camp. We're going to go haul some firewood. There's our makeshift refrigerator. It's keeping all of our dips and stuff almost frozen. This window has got ice on it. It just warmed up a little bit today. Last night was even worse. You almost couldn't even see through the window. But I fired, stayed nice and warm. This is where I slept. I got to sleep on the top bunk, guys. I even brought my, my blanket with me. My toes were two inches from that frosty glass. That blanket in the sleeping bag, it kept me warm. It was all that needed. So now I gotta put on my clothes and we're gonna haul some firewood so we can stay warm. Day two, got some clouds this afternoon. It was a little sunnier this morning, but we went over, had some breakfast. I didn't bring the camera. That's a picnic table there, underneath, or right next to them gas cans. It's our, our loop to and from the lake. Come up on the, through the trees, leave out through the hill, or vice versa. It's a little windy, but through the woods there is to the other camp. 
camp we'll call that camp one and this the green camp here let me get back further show you guys camp here's camp camp two i don't know we might call it the squirrel's nest because uh we had a nice little treat last night from the a welcoming treat from the from some of the guys that helped clean the cabin and get it all ready for us it was wonderful everything was ready i mean everything's everything's great chris had a nice surprise uh waiting in his bed last night uh i'd tell you that one later so anyway i walk you around camp here here's back side of the cabin look at that snow chris is uh chris has been having problems with his snow machine uh he tried hooking up uh uh auxiliary power to it and it's been draining the battery so he's disconnected that so we've been kind of monkeying with that a little bit this afternoon but continuing on the trail through the woods here this is our this is our bathroom it ain't it's kind of a storage shed right now but there's the bathroom everybody wants to see the everybody wants to see the bathroom in the middle of the woods right no plumbing we got a bucket of ashes in there you can guess what that's for and look at that snow just clumping on them trees it's been a lot of fun we're gonna go do some exploring go up to another adjoining lake and uh see what we can see maybe do some fishing hey look my snow machine has it returned uh oh i don't see chris here with a charger so no well, i'll figure it out how's that go jess good wonderful beautiful morning guys yeah we got some snow i think we do it is snowy windy and blowy and we're still at camp there's a little boat shed We've got our sleds ready got to top off the sled with some gas camp didn't fall down we're doing good no sun so so today's uh tournament we have a little fishing tournament up here uh so we're hoping that our camp uh gets to hold on to the trophy that we still have from last year from some of the previous uh fishermen was able to get the tournament for last year so we're really hoping this year that we'll we'll be able to keep that plaque but one day only we'll find out by the end of today so all right we'll see you guys so everything looks a little foggy it's a lot of snow uh i guess this is where we're gonna fish right up there between the point and the island. There goes Chris having some fun. So I gotta get up there and help him set up. Well, can't say I didn't do it. Got my fishing pole in. Kind of just sitting here for a minute. Got Kenny out there. Chris went back to grab a scoop. This is me. I'm sitting, leaning up against my sled, in front of the hole. <laughs> and they're pretty back there, man. Hopefully, we catch something. day here we got probably four more inches of snow last night there were more than what the tracks that you can see on the lake there there was more than just them little tracks uh, but we're pretty snowed over there was a lot of tracks out on the lake and now they're all just snow blowed and covered I think we got here I'll show you the picnic table this is the picnic table there down there that's the top of the picnic table our our snow machines are level with the top of that 
Here's a better angle. That's that's the picnic table. That's the snow. And I think the top little pouch there is everything we got yesterday. It's nuts. Uh, one last look at the front of camp. There's our, our toys. And this is the nice little path through the woods to Camp One. When it is brisk. I'm not walking any further because it looks like I'm going to get some snow on my head if I hit that branch. But just over the hill is camp number one. And there's the lake. And back up to camp number two. Oh, we're just now getting everything loaded up and uh, packed up, I should say, first. Get everything packed up, then we'll get everything loaded up. And back to the truck we go to unload and reload that and then head on home to unload again <laughs> it's fun it's beautiful up here should you agree yes well we're all packed up kind of the way we came in i got a couple totes on my sled my helmet ready generators ready to go back to camp one we're in a Batten down the hatches and uh, close the camp two up and uh, we'll get hitting the road. I think we have a four hour drive ahead of us, at least a four hour drive ahead of us to home. It's just after one o'clock, so here's one, one more look at the lake. Summer, I think we might have to come back and knock out a couple of them trees. Get our view back. It's a little overgrown here. Still pretty cool. Look at that snow. Alright. Well, we made it back to the parking lot. You can see all the cars. And that's one side. The trail entrance is up there by the back of that truck you can see. And then over here, vehicles on all sides. We got lots of people out here this weekend. And we are packed up and ready to go. Still trailers. Me. <laughs> <laughs> that was Jamie's trip to Canada. Holy cow, that was a lot of fun. That was, yeah. It was it was so exhausting. I mean, it was just uh, we were constantly doing things, and and this the amount of snow up there was just it was. You could see great. it. You you clearly yeah, was, you definitely clearly showed how much snow there was. Yeah, that, that was, was pretty crazy. cool. I mean. I, I tried filming more of us playing like with our sleds, but with, I couldn't hold the camera and do anything. So yeah. I'm gonna have to remember like next time I'm gonna bring a GoPro. Yeah, for so sure. That hopefully, be head mounted or something so you guys can see what I get to see. Yeah, because even if you clip it off, it, like if you have it on a head mount, and you can clip it off and like hand it to Chris and he can hold it in his hand while filming. Like yep. there'll there'll just be a yep, lot more options. Or a little sticky mount or something. Yeah. I'll be like here, pull it, put this on your helmet. Right. <laughs> right. But. Yeah, I had a lot of fun. It was it was a lot of fun. We yeah. came in second place in the tournament. It was pretty close. We almost we almost won. Yeah. But I missed you guys. I missed my puppies. <laughs> <laughs> what do you think? She's like, I'm tired. She's like, I missed you too. That's why we snuggled so hard. But now I'm snuggling over here, right? Yeah. So that was Jamie's trip to Canada this time around. Mm -hmm. We wanted to share that with you guys, and now we're going to bed because I'm tired. Are you tired? It's late. It is. So we're going to bed. So as always, you guys, thanks so much for watching. Thanks for subscribing. Stay positive. Dream big. Mm -hmm.
and we see you again soon. I still think we should get a cabin up north. Uh, we definitely have to go back up real soon because they still have a lot of snow up there. Yep, Snowmobile or not, dogs, waterfalls, don't yep, care. I think next week we're going to go. Yep. All right. Good night, audience. If you love our huskies, come along for the ride. All you have to do is hit subscribe. Follow as we share our lives with our dogs and join our adventures on Snow Dog Claws.